y'all. I am having, I'm trying to get out from, one of the rough days ever, one of the rough mornings. So, school started today. We're in D.C. School started today. And my son's father was supposed to buy him some uniform shirts, which he did. He dropped them off on Saturday. I've been asking for like three weeks. He dropped them off on Saturday. For about a month, he knew about these uniform shirts. Um, he dropped them off Saturday evening around 10 p.m. Saturday night. I looked at the shirts. I texted him. When I texted him, I said he needed a youth, me a adult medium. Well, he went to the uniform store, him and his girlfriend bought a youth small and youth medium, which those are the sizes that my, those are the sizes that my um, seven and eight year old wears. So it was no way possible my 13 year old seventh grader was fitting in those shirts. Um, so I, like I said, he dropped them off on Saturday night. Sunday, the uniform store is closed. So I knew on Monday he wouldn't have a shirt because I didn't buy uniform shirts because the agreement was he bought uniform shirts, I bought uniform pants, and he bought the shoes and I bought all, the, all of the school supplies and things like that. Socks and t-shirts and school supplies, book bags. So that was that. This morning I woke up, I dropped the kids off to the elementary school, I dropped my son off to the middle school, I dropped my high schooler off to her high school with the baby and my husband and we went to the uniform store. We got there at 10 o'clock. Right when they open, the gentleman in the uniform store informed me that I can't tra um, trade in the shirts. I wasn't doing a return, like you know, getting money. I just wanted to exchange them. I couldn't exchange the shirts because they was youth meat smalls or mediums, and he needed adult mediums, and the price difference was it was a difference in the price, which I don't understand because every store lets you exchange no matter what. I, I don't know no store that does. It doesn't. Um, and he used a credit card. Okay, cool. I was very heated because the uniform store is 36 minutes from my house. 36 minutes there, 36 minutes back. So, that is over an hour spent on trying to get uniform shirts that I couldn't get. Get back home with my newborn baby and my husband. Um, call him on three-way with my sister because when I called, the girlfriend said he would sleep. So, my sister ended up getting a hold of him. He used a gift card. Okay, a Visa gift card. We know when you use those Visa gift cards, you throw them away. Okay, so we don't have the card. So we called back to the office, spoke with the manager. The manager said, come back in. He didn't know it was the gift card used. Blase, blase. But well, my thing is, I'm a very nice person. Me being nice and cordial and sweet with him didn't mean anything to the manager when I was there. But my sister, who was a little bit more aggressive and her personality is a little bit more stronger, called and... All we had to do is send an email stating, you know, the issue and to bring the uniform shirts back. That pissed me off because why don't we get credit for being nice anymore in this world? Like, just being nice and cordial don't get you anywhere, but acting a fool does sometimes. Anyway, so at this point, my husband is irritated because my son's father, he knew what size to get. I texted him what size. We've known this. I've asked him plenty of times. Did you, did you get get the correct size and he didn't so um the baby is you know in a mood so we had to be i dropped my husband and my baby off and then i went back to the uniform store another 36 minutes there and 36 minutes back i'm on my way back home now i am heated because gas is hot very high so for me to do all of this this morning was an inconvenience like a very big inconvenience i'm just a little irritated i don't know if i'm i don't know if I'm over exaggerating the situation, I guess I know I'm not because this is a situation that didn't need to to happen. Like if you would have just listened, why don't don't people just listen? Listen, it's just been a mess. I'm very tired. The baby was up last night. I have to go back and pick them up. So it's a lot of running and ripping and running, and I just I'm just overwhelmed. I know it's moms out there that just feel overwhelmed sometimes, and I just, today was one of those moments where I just wanted to, I'm on a highway now. I would like to just keep driving. Just keep driving. I don't know where, but just keep driving because I just want to get away from certain situations. I don't know. So it was 11 um, kids shirts that I returned. I ended up getting eight adult shirts because it was a price difference, which is fine. 
Um, I didn't even think he was going to buy that many. So, which is fine. I'll just go buy some more when I get paid or whatever. But, uh, I know I'm not the only one. I just want to put out my hair this morning. And who better to tell than YouTube? Because I can vent and I can express my feelings. And I know there's a mom out there who has been very overwhelmed this morning or very frustrated this morning. And somebody can relate. Now, I'm on my way back in the house with my husband and my son. And he's crying in the house because he's a breastfed baby. Which, he does not like to be without me. He loves his dad. Of course he does. But, he needs me. He's sleeping. He fed him. He changed him. He's tired. And I, I, have, I have the boobs. I have everything he needs to go to sleep. So, I'm rushing back home now to be with my son. This has been a morning. I'm telling you, I'm telling you it's been a morning, but anybody who felt overwhelmed today, anxious, frustrated, out of whack, I'm here for you because I felt the same. You are not alone. You are not alone. I was planning to have a good day. I had my coffee, was ready to start my day on a good note. I was going to do some reels today for Facebook and Instagram and YouTube and put out some content. And this threw me for a loop. Of, a loop, I'm sorry. It threw me for a loop. I just, now my brain is out of whack. I'm just frustrated. So, I mean, in hindsight, I do have the shirts now, so I need to be appreciative. But it just was just extra drama that didn't need to be needed, added to my already chaotic life. You know? Like, I already have eight children any given day in my household. I already have three different schools to drop off to in the morning. I already have a newborn baby. So, this was just wasn't needed at all. 